Some believe the younger races know nothing but constant bloodshed. There were the trolls, before the humans formed the Alliance of Lordaeron. Then the first wave of orcs descended upon them. Nothing seemed to be able to stop these grotesque invaders. It was a slaughter on both sides, all seemingly for no good reason and with no end in sight. But that has changed. With the exception of a few renegade clans, the surviving invaders have been rounded up into enclaves. Now, lasting peace looks to be a promise, but not for all. I believe Deathwing is on the move again. Two of Alexstrasza's get were killed, torn asunder in a manner only one of their own kind could have managed. This would only benefit us. After all, Alexstrasza is still the captive of the Dragonlord clan. These orcs are still using her offspring to wreak havoc all over the Alliance. We have no time to deal with dragons. We need to focus on the Alterac crisis. Now Gilneas has thrown its weight into the situation. Gen Greymane has always sought the leadership of the kingdoms. This will tear the Alliance apart. Still, we can't afford to ignore what is happening around Garzmadan. So long as the orcs hold the Dragon Queen captive, they're a threat to the stability of the land. We need an observer then. Someone to alert us if the situation there becomes critical. But who? We can spare no one now. There is one. There is Ronin. Ronin? After his last debacle? He isn't even fit to wear the robes of a wizard. He's more danger than a hope. I am certain that he has learned his lesson. This time, he will go alone. He shall not even enter Kazmadan. A sphere of seeing will enable him to watch from a distance. Then let us agree on this and be done with the topic. Perhaps if we are fortunate, Deathwing will swallow Ronin, then choke to death, thus finishing forever the matters of both. Ronin, you have been granted your return to our ranks. You are to go to Kazmadan and free the Dragon Queen, Alexstrasza.